Hello guys, and in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a new series called Ready Set Action. I was gonna do like movie time, but I'm like, nah. but I'm introducing a new series called Ready Set Action. It's gonna be a playlist, and I'm gonna be rewatching my old videos where I didn't have editing sequence like zooming in like this and back out. And I didn't have like music that you'll hear in the background. Um, actually, well, you, you'll hear music in the background probably from me talking, but not for, not for the actual video. But let's just, let's just go into it. It'll be a split screen. So I'll screen record it and then pre-watch it while I'm doing, I, I can't explain it. It's hard to explain, but let's get into it. So bad. First thing before you ever before you ever want to go sword fighting, whether it's fencing stuff, just regular sword fighting, doing stuff against your friends, yeah, anything. So it was a year ago. So it can be like here, 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 doesn't matter. Like there. My personal favorite is right here. It's the most comfortable for me, and I feel like I can do most ways to twirl around and attack or to have defensive moves. So first, on once you. Figure out where the most comfortable area to position your sword before a sword fight is. Then you can like start doing tricks and stuff. Then like this one, like I'm gonna do it in regular motion first, but first I'm gonna tell you how to position the sword. So you want the handle facing up, like in the picture right now, and um, you want the blade facing out away from you. And you're gonna bring the sword up, just like this. Then kind of go down and let your hand slide back, and then go up, over, like down, and then go down and then arc like that. So basically, the fast motion, so it get, you get more of a feel of it, it's like this. And then I'm going to go from the back to the beginning. So this is the slow motion, bringing it up, and the hand, hand slide down, up and over, under, and arc. And now here's fast motion. I don't know what I'm doing in this. And once you get that down, you can try to make up your own tricks. And now my brother is going to show you some fencing moves. And let's see him do that. <laughs> let's so, see him do that. With fencing style sword play, you want to keep one foot <clears throat> horizontal to your body, the other foot vertical. Hold your sword out in front of you like this. You want to have quick feet, you can lunge, lunge, parry, block, lunge, poke, lunge, lunge, lunge. Basically, you would just want to have quick feet, do quick lunges, quick blocks, quick lunges. It's basically the basics of fencing style. Then, because fencing style isn't like power thrust, it's more of a quick fast, faster sword play. Yeah. Then with more common faster sword, sword play, play, with like broad sword, sword play, play, you could do like thrusts on the top, slashes, stabs, <laughs> downward cuts, blocks, hit with the, <clears throat> hit with the pommel, or the cross guard, slash, stab, and and also, you have to swing it hard, use it kind of like a club, in a way. Hit with the palm on other things. Like that. And now, me and my brother are going to sword fight. And go. Okay. I am not, um... I don't know if you're ready for this. I'm better than you at sword fighting, so yeah, yes, sense. yeah, that you are. Now, one life, guys, equals one prayer that I survive this. Okay. <laughs> what? So. Right? I have two, and there's two likes on the video. Awesome. Two prayers. Back away from your foot.
Yay, I won. I'm dead. Totally. Yeah, I'm totally dead. And? That is going to be the end of my video today. And I will see you guys on the next video. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh, that was... <laughs> on like the last part, it was literally like this. I will see you guys on the next video. <laughs> so, I can't, I can't believe that actually only has like 46 views. One, it, it has one dislike. Like, and then there's only two tags. It's like Awesome Ninja on my channel. Was named Awesome Ninja back then. But now it's 8NRP. I found a better name. And my goal is to get to 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time so I can monetize my channel. So, if you hit that subscribe, like, um, any of my videos you want, I have some tutorials, I have, I'm looking at it right now, I actually have a fishing adventure, I literally caught a legit fish with a stick, with fishing line, and a hook, and a worm on the hook, like, on a stick, and I literally put it in the Fox River, <laughs> and it caught, like, it was due to, like, a white, um, crappy or a uh, smallmouth bass but like bah my last video was a tutorial was how to x up uh, see how many views that has like my channel you wouldn't consider good consider on the downside i've been on it i'll go to my about tab um i've been on i joined on june 29th 2019 but, yeah, I could really use the support, as you can see. Now, I'm scrolling down to my most viewed video. Oh, one of my, one of my most fun videos um, to make was Hide and Seek Battle Part 2. And just the Hide and Seek um, Part 1. And last to leave a um, giant-sized board game, there's another video that I haven't uploaded I'll give you a little peeks um and you can keep checking out my channel um but it is called last to leave their bedroom wins ten thousand dollars so make sure once it gets up you can check it out and you can watch some of my older videos while you are waiting for that so one second let me get all the way down instead of Oh, the weirdest video I've ever made and the most pointless hat flipping battle or hat throwing competition. Like, so pointless. So, just to give you a reference, my second most viewed video has 247 views. I'm like cringing as I say that. And my most viewed has 383. So, yeah. And that's, um, actually I'll just go into that later, but, yeah, I could really, 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 really use the support. But thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you later.